When it comes to groundbreaking directors who have pushed the boundaries of cinema, few names shine as brightly as Ho Xiaoxian. Once hailed as one of the three directors most crucial to the future of cinema, Ho was born in Guangdong in 1947, before his family relocated to Taiwan, where he launched his acclaimed career. As a pioneer of the New Taiwan Cinema Movement in the 1980s, Ho began capturing international attention with his raw yet poetic portrayals of everyday people. His early works explored coming-of-age stories and cultural shifts from rural to urban life. But it was his fourth film, A City of Sadness, that cemented his reputation as an artistic visionary. The first movie to confront Taiwan's traumatic white terror era, the film stunned the world by winning the Golden Lion at the Venice Film Festival in 1989. His signature minimalism and long takes seemed to meditate on the very essence of time itself. Over the next 30 years, Ho continued crafting poignant stories on big screens. Ho's films speak to universal themes of cultural memory, lost innocence, and the relentless tide of change through patient observation of the human condition. Although Ho is now retired after 40 years of filmmaking due to dementia, the legend remains a master of poetic realism that resonates across borders and generations.